All right, ladies and gentlemen, after you've completed writing your journals, get to our Mod Tech class and look for the fun April 12th lesson. It's not mandatory if you miss class for M-Step, but fun if you want to take the time. The first choice is how to get to the website. Uh, click Sculpt GL, and it will launch this site. And then once you're in the site, you can use the Today's Lesson playlist that you will see this training in to f learn how to work the program. Have fun and make sure you show me the cool appropriate things you create. Sculpt GL is a 3D uh, program that lets you build with clay. Right now it's got symmetry on so that's why it looks like it's going to do two dots. I'd like you to shut that off and it's going to accumulate clay. So when we touch this, I'd like to make a nose. I'd like us to all make a person. So you can see when I start pulling, that nose accumulates and it starts to push out. If I push in my scroll wheel, I can drag right and left. If I right click and drag, it orbits so I can see that nose start to grow a little bit. If I roll my wheel in and out, you can see I can adjust it more. So I am grabbing that nose and I'm pulling it to make it so that it brushes out and then I keep clicking to make it look a little bit like a nose. Fiddle around and make yours look like a nose and then go to the next training movie. The nice thing about this program is it's got undo which is control Z and it also has very few instructions you just get to play. So let's try shutting off accumulate. Let's turn symmetry back on and let's switch to inflate alright so now I'm gonna inflate two eyes when I click and drag they start to pop out I kinda like the way inflate worked better than uh, the brush tool so now I'm gonna shut off and I'm gonna tweak my nose so it inflates a little bit more as well let's quickly make our brush a little bit smaller and let's do eyebrows still with symmetry on so now it does both eyebrows at the same time. When you've got that done, go to the next training movie. All right, let's try a new tool. Let's go down to crease. And uh, let's see if we can make this dude have a mouth. Uh, if we do symmetry, we can do it from the middle, and it splits on both sides. I'm going to shut off symmetry so I can finish it. And connect those two pretty darn slick if you go back to it and start again making sure you're in the middle it doesn't have that oops that I had and you can make it a little bit deeper if you ever don't like what you did you can do control Z to back up see what you can do to give your dude a cool little mouth alright the rest of your time I will let you just explore you can try whatever pieces you want uh, I have moved or played with quite a few of these, uh, but I am by no means an expert. I'm just fiddling with them, seeing what I can learn about it. Uh, it is quite powerful, and uh, you can do pretty cool stuff pretty darn fast. Uh, explore, have fun, and when you're finished, click File and choose Save as SGL so you don't lose your file. Uh, mine it just saved right to the uh, hard drive and it called it yourmess.sgl I have did it twice so it's got two names if you do open in folder you can check out where it's saved uh, mine saved in a users harmon downloads folder so if we want to get back to it another day that's where it's at if you can paint it and stuff that is awesome but it's really just about exploring and learning what we can do when you're done with that, head out to your modules and have a great day.